Emma from Tutorials by E and today I am going to show you how to make this really awesome flower power charm. This is my own design and it is pretty easy to make. You are going to need 8 A color bands, I am using the jelly turquoise, 9 B color bands, I am using the opaque pink, and 8 C color bands, I am using jelly purple. You will also need your loom, you can use a rainbow loom or a monster tail, and your hook as well as a C clip. Let's get started. Starting with your red arrow pointing up, take an A color band and stretch it from this peg up one to the left. Go up one and then one more and then go over one to the right. Then go down one to the right, down two, and then it comes time to put on our last one. And to do this, we're going to need to take off this band, put this one on, and put our band back on so that the hooking goes better. Push all your bands down, trying not to, trying to keep them in order as you do this. And now we're ready to put on our B color bands. First, take one. Twist it into a figure eight and fold it on top of itself. If you're using a monster tail loom, you can just hold it in your fingers for the next part. But if you're using rainbow loom like me, just stretch it across the two middle pegs. All right, so we're going to put our hook inside this band, grab another band, pull our hook through, put it on a peg, and then fold it on top of itself. We are going to do this seven more times so that all of our pegs have a band. After you put on the first one, if you're using a monster tail loom, then you can just um, let it hang there and it should be okay as you put on the other ones. It is also helpful to twist your loom around as you work. Alright, we're almost done. And now we are to our last one. It does not matter in what order you do these. There. Alright, now that's done. We are going to push all these bands down and put on our next layer. Using your C color bands, make capping bands by taking a band, twisting it into a figure eight and folding it on top of itself and then putting it on a peg. We're going to do this seven more times so that all of our pegs have a band. Alright, and then we we're going to push our bands down again. These will form the outer petals on our flower, and they look nice. Alright, now push all your bands down again, so that we have more room as we hook. And let's get ready to hook. Alright, stick your, grab your hook and stick it inside all of these bands on this peg. Find the bottom A colored band pull it up through this peg and on to the one to the right. Then go inside the, this one, find the bottom A color band, pull it up through and put it on the next peg. There's a lot of tension on this band as you do it, so be very careful. Sometimes you have to use your fingers a little bit. And keep doing this all the way around.
bands really like to stick on to the sides of the pegs sometimes. So it can be a bit hard. Oops. And also sometimes they fall off of your hook. We are almost done. All right, now to finish this, you can either do what I do and pull this bottom band through all of them and then put a C clip on, or you can take another band um, and put it through all of these and then tie a slip knot. But I'm just going to put my hook into all of these grab the bottom band and pull it up through all of the other ones. And then I'm gonna put on my C-clip and let it stay there, but I'm also going to just pull this off and then put it there, because if it goes through this loop, it's just gonna fall apart. Now you get to take off all your bands. You have to be very careful while doing this, so you can either use your hook or your fingers, if you use your fingers, just slide them up gently and off because you don't want to mess up the outer petals. There. All right, once it comes off your loom, just kind of adjust and play around with it. I like to even out my outer petals. Or you can just leave it the way it is if you like it. And there you have finished your flower power charm. Alright, so I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. You can attach this charm to your backpack or anything else you want to. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you like it. And subscribe to my channel. See you next time.